Kashmiris on both sides of line of control and the world over observed Indian Independence Day today as Black Day to convey the message to the international community that New Delhi continues to deny them their inalienable right to self-determination. The day was marked by a complete shutdown and civil curfew in Indian illegally occupied Jammu and Kashmir call for which had been given by the All Party Suriyat Conference due to the strike the Kashmir Valley wore a deserted look. The occupation authorities converted the entire Kashmir Valley into a military garrison as checkposts and barricades were erected at all main squares and points from north to south Kashmir. The roads leading to the cricket stadium at Sonavar in Srinagar, the main venue of the official function, were sealed. Despite restrictions, a mysterious blast took place when a BJP sarpanch was unfurling Indian flag at Panchayat Ghar in Narbalakut area of Mender in Punch district today. The All Parties Hurriyat Conference leadership in a statement said, India is rejoicing on its freedom but killing Kashmiris for demanding the same. It pointed out that New Delhi has mercilessly killed over 96,000 Kashmiris in the past 32 years but is shamelessly observing its Independence Day in the territory. The People's Democratic Party President Mehbooba Mufti today hit out at the Bharati Janata Party-led Modi government for forcing Kashmiri people to join the charade of patriotism on India's Independence Day. She posted a video on her Twitter account wherein government employees were seen threatening shopkeepers to pay Rs 20 for the Hargar Tiranga campaign. The Modi-led Indian regime announced the renaming of 199 schools, colleges and roads in Indian illegally occupied Jammu and Kashmir after slain Indian armed forces personnel with an aim to Hinduize the Muslim-majority territory. Black flags were hoisted and protest rallies were held in Azad Kashmir, Pakistan and world major capitals to draw global attention towards the Indian brutalities in Indian illegally occupied Jammu and Kashmir. APHC AJK chapter today staged a protest demonstration in front of the Indian High Commission in Islamabad. An Indian policeman who sustained injuries during a cordon and search operation in Huatta area of Srinagar the other day succumbed at a hospital in the city today.